welcome back guys so today we're in the field and we are working on surgical tables and I want to give you guys a few pointers when you're working on surgical tables to be aware of which could dramatically reduce the amount of time you spend troubleshooting these things all right so one of the first things that you have to make sure is that the table is fully charged right no matter what and that means you got to start at the power cord and check for power cord retention we've got a whole series of them to work on here and before you start working on a table make sure it's plugged in make sure it shows that it's charging and make sure that the power cord has appropriate retention on the pins if it doesn't replace the power cord okay let it plug in and charge for a little bit and then start diagnosing especially if it's a charge error or low battery stairs tables I've talked about it many times before the micro switches that detect when the brakes are down of course the table will not function if it thinks the brakes are not down all right so go through and thoroughly check to make sure that it thinks that it's locked down your hand control hand controls will generally not work if you think that the table is not locked down these spine tables the spine table operates at one end this is the drive end and down there that is a passive end which just has an electronic brake and some micro switches which detect what its position is that end generally doesn't do very much but over here are the batteries this side is the side that it plugs into the side over there is the side that has the batteries they place them at two opposite sides so on this side you have the motor controller and you have um, the DC power supply. On that side, you have the batteries, and uh, we're gonna open it up and do an inspection. So during table PMs, if you don't have a battery change sticker on the outside, open it up, check the hydraulics, make sure it's okay, and make sure that the batteries are within the last two years. Because if they're not in the last two years, that means that you are getting the last year worth of life support on that battery and you need to budget for replacement some of these tables have very expensive batteries so guys we have a whole selection of surgical tables that we're going to be working on today and this is one of the services that we offer at Foby is to do on-site repairs and pms of surgical tables because we're pretty good at it it's one of those things that we like doing 